Hey guys, I'm Abby Lyons and I'm going to show you how to play Run by Taylor Swift and Ed Sheeran on the ukulele. If you'd like the lead sheet and the play along video to practice this song, come join us over on Patreon. So we have five chords in the song, they're all down here, and if you already know them, feel free to skip ahead. So our first chord is C. You're either going to use your third finger or the pinky on the third fret of the first string, and here's C. So the reason you can use the third finger or the pinky is whatever feels comfortable transitioning into this next chord, which is F sus2. So for F sus2, you're going to add the first finger to the first fret of the second string, and here's F sus2. Or you can have that pinky right here. Then our next chord is D minor. You're going to put your first finger on the first fret of the second string, second finger on the second fret of the fourth string, and your third finger on the second fret of the third string. And here's D minor. Then we have A minor. You're going to put your second finger on the second fret of the fourth string. Here's A minor. And then our last chord is G. You're going to put your first finger on the second fret of the third string, second finger on the second fret of the first string, and your third finger on the third fret of the second string. Here's G. And those are all of our chords. For our strumming pattern, we're going to be using down, down, up, up, down, up, one time on each chord. So on C, that sounds like this. Down, down, up, up, down, up. And then also sometimes you're going to see a slash next to the chord. That means we're going to just strum one time on that chord and then hold for four beats. So first we're going to learn how to play the verse. Our chord progression is down below. We have C going to F sus2, and this is actually our whole progression. It happens eight times in a row. Here it is with the strumming pattern. We have C, F sus2, and again, it'll happen eight times all together. So here's the whole verse now with the words. Give me the keys, I'll bring the cup. We shouldn't be in this town And my so-called friends, they don't know I drive away before I let you go So give me a reason and don't say no, no So that's the verse now we're going to learn how to play the pre-chorus. Our chord progression is down below. We have D minor, A minor, C, and then G. Here it is with the strumming pattern. D minor, A minor, C, and G. This is going to happen two times, and on the second time, we have a slash on that G chord, so we're going to strum just one time on that chord. So here it is the second time. We have D minor, A minor, C, and then one strum on G. So that's the whole pre-chorus. Here it is now with the words. There's a chain round your throat, piece of paper where I wrote, I'll wait for you. There's a key on the chain, there's a picture in a frame, take it with you. So that's the pre-chorus. Now we're going to learn how to play the chorus. The first part of our chord progression we have seen before, again, it's that C to F sus2 chord progression. This time it happens only four times, and then we have a different line. We're going to have A minor, G, then two times on F sus2. So here's that line with the strumming pattern. We have A minor, G, F sus2, 
and again. And then again, we're going to have C to F sus 2 four times. So it's like that progression, the new progression, and then sandwiched around the same chord progression. <laughs> so <laughs> hope that makes sense. <laughs> so here it is now all the way through with the words. And run like you'd run from the law. Darling, let's run. Run from it all. We can go where our eyes can take us. Go where no one else is. Run. Ooh, we'll run. Ooh, we'll run. Ooh, we'll run. So that's how you play the chorus. Now, last of all, we're going to learn the bridge. The first half of our chord progression is below. Here it is with the strumming pattern. We have F sus 2, then a second time, and then G, and a second time on G. And then here's the second half of our chord progression. Look out for the slash at the end. That's just one strum on that F sus 2 chord. So here's the second line. We have A minor, then A minor again, then F sus 2, and one strum. <laughs> Alright, so here's the bridge all the way through with the words now. There's been this hole in my heart, this was a shot in the dark. then we would go into the final chorus. That's how you play Run by Taylor Swift and Ed Sheeran. Sorry if you can hear my radiator starting to hum. It's a little cold here in Chicago, so the heat is starting to come on. <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching. If you liked this video, please like it and please subscribe. Again, if you would like those lead sheets and play along videos for all the tutorials that I do, come join us over on Patreon. The support is really very much appreciated and it helps me keep making these videos for you guys. So I believe that's everything. Please have a very lovely day and I'll see you again really soon. Bye. <laughs>